A wild sight of wacky characters taking over the convention center in downtown Lexington this weekend. The annual comic and toy convention has visitors packing local restaurants and hotels. LEX 18's Catherine Collins tells us that this is the biggest Comic-Con here yet. The comic book characters, the superheroes, even SpongeBob and Patrick. We're best friends in real life, so we decided to dress up yeah. as like characters that were best friends. They're all here for the Lexington Comic and Toy Convention. We came last year and there definitely were not as many people here. Organizers say they expect about 30,000 people at the event. It's the biggest Comic Con since it began seven years ago. This is a little tiny thing and it has grown and grown and grown and grown and, and every year it just exceeds my expectations wildly. Promoter Jared Greer says the big crowds mean good things for downtown businesses too. All the restaurants seem to run out of food or not be able to seat anybody else, and uh, all the hotels are surely sold out for the weekend. We've been nonstop. We slowed down for a little bit, but then we would pick right back up immediately. Catherine Burns is a hostess at Pies and Pints right across the street from the convention center. She says a packed restaurant means she and her coworkers make more money. It's good for business. And she can expect more crowds tomorrow as Comic Con continues for day three. Tickets for Sunday are still available. Covering the news in Lexington. Catherine Collins, LEX 18 News. Organizers say it's the big names like Chuck Norris at Comic-Con that drew so many people this year. 